All right, so now we are recording, um, whatever day it is, what day is it? Day next, we're a day behind, so. Probably day 10. Today we're, day 10, day 10. It's, sure, sounds like it. We'll call it day 10. Recording day 10, we, first we went to the, the basically today we did the Parthenon, but bef uh, and below the Parthenon, which is on the Acropolis of Athens. There's a lower part, which is kind of the old city of Athens. And down there, we saw an old, the, uh, the Temple of Hephaestus, which is actually a mini version of the Parthenon. I think that that was the, like the, actually the scale model of the Parthenon, which was actually intact, unlike the Parthenon. And then saw the other ancient sites there. There was a ruin that said House of Simon, it was Simon the Cobbler that they detected, so we thought we liked that. We thought that was fun. And then there was a, a museum there that was actually a recon a building that was reconstruct. How, how, what would we say? Reconstructed. It was a. Yeah, it wasn't restored because to restore something has to be the majority has to be original materials. So they just it was like a mo uh, yeah like a. It was a replica, replica. effectively, a replica using some original materials um, of a building. I don't know what it's called, um, the marketplace thing. It was the Agora, right? The Agora, I think it's the whole area. Agora okay. shopping place. Agora, okay. So it was, a, it was an Agora. Long, really, really long, um, kind of narrow building that was rebuilt to be like a, a model of it. And there was a museum in there that had a lot of artifacts. So we did that, and then we went up to the Acropolis, and there we went to Mars Hill, uh, teaching up there, saw Mars Hill, which is really just a rock, and that's just right outside the Parthenon, and then went up to the actual Acropolis, where we saw the Parthenon, saw the old temple to Athena, and then we had lunch, explored Athens, did some shopping, you forgot the museum. Oh yeah, and we went to the museum after lunch, after lunch, went to the museum, which was a, a very modern museum that housed tons of artifacts from the uh, Parthenon and other areas around. Basically most of this, but I had, just had a lot of artifacts from the area. Um, after the museum, did some shopping, went back to the hotel, went to bed. So my favorite part of the day was going to the Parthenon. The, the Parthenon was super cool. I mean, it's, it's really huge and impressive. Um, least favorite part, uh, I don't know. I didn't have a least favorite part. It, it, was a, it was a fun day. I liked it. It was a lot of exploring. Um, Actually, probably the least favorite part was the, the old ruins of the area. Um, oops. Um, old ruins of the area down, down below was my least favorite part. Just we've seen a lot of ruins. And so that was it's less interesting to see ruins. It's like yet more ruins. So that was less interesting, um, but still, but still cool. Um, what did I learn? Um, learned that kind of how impressive the Roman or the Greek building techniques were. They built the Parthenon in only a few years. Um, and, and that meant that they, they had something like eight cranes. They built wooden cranes, they had eight of them, and they were lifting something like 15 tons of marble every 15 minutes to build the, um, to build the Parthenon. So really, really impressive kind of engineering and logistics operations to, to get that whole thing put together. Um, Sarah, go. Um, yeah, it's fun to type. Um, yeah, my favorite part was seeing the Parthenon. That was really cool. So Acropolis, again, the recap. Acropolis is two words. Acro means the very top of. Polis means city, so top of the city. So you can also say Acro, which is very top of, and then you can say the city name. So it would have been Acro Athens. So there were a bunch of stuff up there. There were 
three temples to Athena up there. The Parthenon was the biggest. Um, they were all to Athena. She was the most important, yada, yada, because she was the basis for their name. But it was really cool to see the Parthenon I learned about it in college. Um, so something I learned, actually I'm going to tell you two things, but the first thing um, was that the Greeks did not have slaves, unlike the Romans and other cultures. So all of that, the Parthenon and everything that we see was actually built by paid freemen. So they have records of like the ledgers that said um, names and their job and what they did. So it's just really neat to, to know that it wasn't slave labor, that um, freemen built it and were paid for it, um, which was really neat. And then the other thing is, is I have this association of Greek statues that maybe aren't dressed up top and are female as being just more common, but they said that that was actually only Aphrodite because she was trying to be kid friendly. Um, so it, they said they respected Greek women. So the Greek women um, were always clothed in the statues. And if they, if she is not fully clothed, then that means it's Aphrodite. I did not know that. And I was really pleased to see that in Aphrodite, the way that they carved her was their standard of highest standard of beauty. And she actually has really muscular shoulders and biceps and deltoids. She's like, she, she's ripped. So I thought that was cool that their standard of beauty included a very strong woman. So it was neat. My least favorite part was that they, we had to meet by the buses really early, which meant everyone had to eat breakfast at 7 a.m. And they did not release us for lunch until after 1 p.m. So it was really long. So it was, some of us were hangry. I had a hunger headache. I mean, I don't want to say, I don't want to come across as complaining, but basically they fit a ton in and then like released us for a meal way late. But you know, it was fun, after, you know, or the meal was fun when we finally got to eat. It's meal. already seven minutes long, mom. All right, go ahead, your turn. It's cause dad was talking. My favorite part about today was, uh, was uh, going on, the, I mean, my favorite part about the day was going on the walk. My least favorite part. Uh, Which walk? walk? Which one? You know, at, after the museum. Oh, yeah, when we walked around Athens? Yeah. Okay. And my least favorite part was having to wait on, on Mom at the clothes shop because it was taking forever. Yeah, I went clothes shopping. And then I don't really know what I learned. Something that holds I think up. I learned to be patient that day, no. I guess. Maybe. Because it's a fine answer. Simon. Okay, what I learned was that there was a house of Simon, and my favorite part was finding out there, that there was a house of Simon, and my least favorite part was waiting on Mom. I thought your favorite part was getting your rubber band out. I didn't get in yesterday. Yeah, you did. Yeah, you did. What, I did? It was when yeah. I was shopping. When I was clothes shopping, you guys were so bored, that's when you found your rubber band gun. Oh. <laughs> All right. So that, that was our day.